See at the beginning of the movie. A small meteorite comes from the sky and falls on the earth. The story is about a small area of South Carolina, named Wilson. In the next scene, we see Grant. Grant is a rich man. He is old in appearance but he is married to a young woman her name is Starla. On the other hand we see Bill. Bill has known Starla since childhood and is also in love with her. Then we see Grant and Starla get into an argument. He goes outside to have a drink. He is drinking alcohol sitting in a bar. He meets Brenda she already knows Grant. And then these people drink alcohol all night. Then both of them go to the forest. This is the place where that small meteorite fell. Grant then sees a strange shell. Then he sees a strange sticky worm lying on the ground. He touches her with a stick. The worm lets out a stinger and hits it in Grant's chest. He falls on the ground at the same time. The stinger that is inserted in his chest reaches his brain. Grant wakes up and his eyes and nose start bleeding. He looks around strangely. It seems Grant's condition are not good. Then he goes home. After the incident, many changes start happening in the Grant. In the morning Starla apologizes to Grant for the fight that night. And she leaves. Grant starts doing weird stuff. He goes to the market and buys a lot of meat. Coming home, he acts weirdly. He kills his own dog. Grant goes to the basement and locks the basement door outside. So that no one else can enter. When Starla asks him about locks he says that I am planning something for your birthday. Grant begins to feel a strange feeling in his chest and also has strange marks on his neck. Strange tentacles start coming out of his chest like needles. Grant can't control himself because parasite alien is in his brain is controlling him. He thinks to make Starla like himself, but he does not because he is in love with her. He says I have some work and leaves from there. He reaches to the Brenda home. And he inserts tentacles into Brenda's abdomen and lays its eggs in her abdomen. Brenda then goes missing from her home. Starla comes back home from the party. She asks what happened to your face. Grant tells me I've been stung by bees and I've met Dr. Carl. The next morning Starla talks to Dr. Carl and asks about Grant. He says it's been one year since I met your husband, he didn't come here. Starla notices that a lot of pets are disappearing from the town. On the other hand, we see Grant, who has kept Brenda in a secluded place. From that day onwards his body does not remain normal. She gets very hungry and starts eating raw meat. Two cops come to Starla's house and ask her where's Grant? They tells Brenda Gutierrez is missing from Friday night she was found to have been forcibly taken away from her home. The neighbors have last seen Grant going to his home. Bill say call me if Grant comes home? Starla feels something wrong and she calling to the Bill. Grant arrives at the same time. He says I can't trust you anymore and is going to kill her too with his tentacles. There the police arrive and rescue Starla but Grant escapes there. After three days. Mayor Jack arrives at the police station, he tells Bill that we need to find Grant. He is stealing animals from the town. Bill guessing where the Grant will attack next? And he leaves with own the team. On the other side we see Mr. Strutemeyer his family. He has a wife and three daughters, the name of the eldest daughter is Kylie. Bill and his team reaches to the Mr. Straitmeyer forms. Then the police team surrounds the farm from all sides and wait for the arrival of Grant. And Grant comes there. He looks like a scary monster. He killed a policeman and runs away from their place. They all run after him and reach the place where he has kept Brenda. Those people get Brenda she is puffed up like a balloon because she has eaten too much meat. Still he is hungry. It the next moment she explodes and the babies of the parasite alien come out of her stomach. Actually worms take their control by entering people's mouth and their brains are intertwined. On the other hand, these worms also reach Mr. Strutemeyer house. This worm also attacks Kylie and Kylie joins him for a few moments. She finds out where the alien worm came from and why it came. Then she pulls it all out of her mouth and kills. Then she sees that her whole family has come under the control of these worms. She locks herself in the car then Bill arrives and rescues her. Then Bill saves Starla and Mayor Jack as well and drives away in a car. Kylie tells everyone if we have to stop all this then we will have to kill Grant. Otherwise these worms will go on spreading. These people are going to another place. Only then a van collides with their car. They people take Starla and Mayor Jack away. Kylie and Bill escape from them and run away. Then Bill goes to the police station to get the grenade. Then a deer attacks Bill and Kylie kills the deer and saves Bill. On the other side we see Starla as they are preparing well. When Starla regains consciousness she lying on bed in her house. She can't run away because the windows of her house are blocked. Then she decides to kill Grant. She talks sweetly to Grant and attacks him on the head with a sharp weapon. He does not die and grabs Starla in his tentacles. Bill reaches the place. Bill is about to blow Grant up with a grenade but he is unable to do so as Grant throws him away. 
and his grenade explodes in the swimming pool. And Grant shoves his tentacles into Bill's stomach. Bill grabs his second tentacle and attaches it to the switch of the gas cylinder. Bill tells Starla to shoot Grant. Grant explodes due to gas in the body. With that everything goes well. On the other hand, we see that there is still a tentacles of anger in Bill's stomach. But he is fine it becomes like them only when both the tentacles enter its stomach. And with this the story ends. Subscribe for more videos like this live a like to the channel help out thanks for watching have a great day.